Hello World of Warby, this is Jade from Jade's Video. So this is just another having fun in my Halloween room video. I wanted to make this one because it is really foggy in here. As you can see, you can hardly see anything. Um, and I just thought it's really cool and that it deserves a video so you guys can see. It's actually, you can actually see stuff better on the camera, which is weird. But I don't know if I'll play servers anymore with the fog, uh, press servers anymore with the fog machine tonight because when I go to sleep, I don't want this to still be in here. Um, but I'll show you Big Mouth Billy Bones where I put him. Uh, this is to keep him still. But it's also cool because it's like he's on water because this is the ghost ship area. And yeah, I rearranged lighting. And a few props, like the props that were in his spot. This light was actually shining on Barnard Butcher, but it was the red one, the red cover over it, but I put the blue cover to make it seem like water, like, shining up on him from the sea, and, um, that was shining on him, but now it's over there shining on Cornstalker, which in my opinion looks really cool. I'll just plug in Convulsing Nurse real quick so you can see her. Haven't showed her in a while. She deserves some uh, camera time. It's been Cerberus mainly lately. Hello. There she goes. sound sensor. Uh, Barnyard Butcher deserves to have some camera time right now too. Haven't showed him in a while. Looking for his switch. Okay, I think this is it. Yep. There he goes. His motor does look like it's been slowing down over the years. Of course, he is a 2012 prop, so. No, why? Okay. I'll probably do Cerberus just one more time so I could get him in this video. I can't tell you how refreshing it is to be amongst the living once again. However temporary this can be. Just one more time. So you can be in the video. Come on, Cerberus. Show him you're number one. Okay, Cerberus, no more. We've already let out enough fog. <laughs> okay. Anyways, oh, this prop I didn't show you guys yet. This is actually a homemade prop I made. Uh, it's just this dragon toy, this like one foot uh, 
one and a half feet tall uh, dragon toy and I painted like blood all on its claws and stuff and its eyes are just completely orange and some orange in its mouth to look like fire. Um, I made it into this really cool dragon prop and he's over here in Hell Corner and he looks really cool, especially by the flame light. Focus on that. Trying to focus. There we go. Okay, so Harbinger of Hell. My new Harbinger I am going to get on Wednesday when they get more in stock. And yes, he will go in the same spot right there, right where the fog machine is. He'll go in the same spot. Uh, that light is still there, the fire and ice light. <laughs> well, the only reason it's not, it's only shining on the wall <coughs> is because that's where Harbinger used to be, of course, and it was shining on him. Um, but... I, since he's broken and I'm getting a new one, he's not there of course, but um, when I, I'm keeping it in that same spot only because, um, I mean, why you, why move it just for a few days before I get a new one, because I'll just keep it in the same spot so it's shining on him when I get a new one. Um, anything else I should tell you guys about? Don't really think so. Oh yeah! Uh, in case you didn't watch my last video, I could get $300 from these Hess trucks I have from when I was little. I could get $300 from them by selling them on eBay. And that will go towards buying Incinerator and maybe another life size with just a whole bunch of small props. I have no idea, but Incinerator, he's the most likely this year. Smoldering Zombie, I'm going to get in like nine days, I believe. And he will replace Headless Horseman. Headless Horseman's probably going to go in my second Halloween room, which isn't as cool as this one. Um, and it's just start All it's got in there is Coat Rack Monster, and it's just my office. Um, and that's why it... Well, the office. It's not my office. It's just for the whole family. Um, that's... But I go in there a lot, so that's why he's in there. And that second Halloween room is it could have all this lighting and stuff. It's just an area I'll put my props that I don't have space for in here. So that's uh, why I don't show that. But I could show it real quick. Here's Harbinger's box. Okay, here's where the second Halloween room is. See, it's really nothing except for coat rack. So, um, that uh, Halloween room is actually... Right, I don't know, I'll just film the ground. I'm filming the ground because I don't want to show you our house. But it's actually just right in there. So it's actually down the hall away from my hallway. Um, so yeah, it's actually, it's, a, it's not like right next to this one. It is, uh down the hall a bit but and you gotta go down the hall a little bit then you gotta turn the corner and go down the rest of the hall and you gotta go through the kitchen and then you're in it but just to let you guys know it's just this separate little area and that's probably where headless horsehood's gonna go in there um shining music is on um anyways Barnard Butcher. It's time to build a new scarecrow. Here's a start. <laughs> so let me just play the pri pirate a few more times. And man, no, he is a gigantic frog. He is huge. Um, you know what, you guys have, I don't really know if you guys have seen him very much before. Um, he's not a scary prop or anything, but he's still really cool and I like the song he plays. Oh, 
Um, token drop. And yet again, I'm using my Halloween uh, song playlist that I that I created um, with all my favorite Halloween songs on it. Those are three feet tall props, like I mentioned before. They're just on my shelf, so that's why they look so big. And of course, I'm not turning on all of my props, just some of them. Of course, these aren't even all my props. A lot are still in storage. Uh, we decorate my whole house in about a few weeks. A week? Two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah, two weeks. I hope this fog clears out soon because my bed is right there. It's where I sleep, so... Alright, so I'm gonna turn off the fog machine right now because I guess it's <laughs> messing with other equipment in the house because it is a 1,000 watt, so... Oh, there's an advertisement on the playlist right now. I'm gonna have to turn that off in a minute. So... There we go. Fog machines unplugged. What song's playing now? I know this is a pretty long video, but. <clears throat>
actually trying to get all the props into this video. I'm obviously not going to though, but because the video is already long enough. Stop working. Wait. Yep, it did. Now the only thing that works on him is his head and his eyes. Like, move this dragon back. Okay, this video is becoming a little too long, I understand, so I think I'm going to end it about now. If you want to see all of my props up to date in my whole Halloween room, well not all of them, like I said, some are still in storage until a few weeks from now, but if you want to see my whole Halloween room for this year with all the props, um... You could go check out my Halloween room walkthroughs, and there will be an updated one coming very soon. Keep howling at the moon, my werewolves. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.